The time is 7 a.m. And it's time now for the Peter Channel Morning News on this Friday morning, May 5th, 2017. Ka! 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 to you all this lovely Friday morning, May 5th, 2017. It's 7 a.m. And our top story on the Peter Channel Morning News at 7 is Donald Trump been at it. Now, Obamacare repeal bills that the president just posted was on the cusp of passing was settling in total again. President Manning talked to the Federal Congress wouldn't talk for bombshell hours earlier. Marcus Vance on Macron's first round victory and they'll likely do so again on Monday expected to declare a new French president. Beijing, North Korea accused the U.S. of South Korean intelligence agencies of Friday the party to kill the day's leader Kim Jong-un and use a biochemical agents at China State News Agency in Zedua reported. Hours after a squad in the victory in the Nassau effectively killed Obamacare, U.S. President Donald Trump embraced Australia's help. Care system, which is universal during a press conference with Prime Minister Malcolm Turnbull. Top court about Zeb says it raped the chop India. Prince Philip is retired, but Queen Elizabeth II won't advocate, according to experts. London, the year's skept the UK Independence Party has suffered a collapse in the sport while the Conservatives have made significant gains local elections in England, Scotland, and Wales, early results in Canada on Friday. The hospital that was damaged in an airstrike and a rebel controlled town and announced Chris at Damascus. Ivanka Trump, the daughter of an aide and a man who has elected to draw women among the largest parts of American history, has published a new book. Donald Trump abandoned his schedule to make sure he will still be in Washington to savor his biggest list station win and yet as president. Washington from the White House standing room was the cable net where it's carried the Thursday's health care vote live. President Trump on Thursday signed an executive order aimed at making it easier for the church to participate in politics, taking a deliver on it, a campaign pledge by a community that already backed in him in the last year's election. The health care bill passed by the House Part Republicans closer to the goal of erasing the Bobby care from the books, but also providing another long church aspiration. Cut it off the flow of federal funds to Planned Parenthood. Canberra source sells a scratch ticket worth a billion dollars and was at the Witch Hill food shops on Pleasant Street in Annaber. No online sales tax had taken effect on July the 1st. Lost dog from North Carolina found in Annaber. China's new jet line is the Comex C 990 takes part for the first time. The wide alien service viewer is under fiscal over software to the use of the bait law enforcement to try to crack down in their service. Delta Airlines faced a public relations problem after a family claimed they were kicked off of the fight for reasons to give up a child seat. The House Financial Service Committee approved a bill on Thursday to reveal where it will act a significant piece of the Dodd Frank Wall Street Reform and Consumer Protection Act. Looking at stock to now, that's 4.3 points of trade at 51.47, SP5 up 1.39 points of 2892, 52, and Nasdaq up 2.79 points of 6,075.34. I made the new video shows just what NASA's Cassidy spacecraft saw during its first grid finale plunge between Saturn's cloud tops and the gas jet rigs last week. Uh, the first stage of the Falcon 9. Rockets ascended into the landing platform of the Pastor Ocean Pond and the 2014 flood from the Federal Air Force Base in California. Peter Chell News Live is 703 on this Friday morning, and it's time now for a New England report. Two hours ago, in Templeton, Massachusetts, a three alarm fire on Baltimore Road at New Route 16, EMS was valued one firefighter for head injury. And now, look at sports. Yesterday, the Boston Red Sox fall to the Baltimore Orioles 8 to 5, and the Boston Celtics get trashed by the Washington Wizards 160 to 89. And the Gold State Warriors defeat the Utah Jazz in game number two to the West Coast semifinals with a 115 104 victory. Tonight, the Boston Red Sox open up a three-game series up in the Twin Cities of Minneapolis St. Paul against the Minnesota Twins. Game time, 8, 10 p.m. in the Dalton Lancers. Lacrosse, doubleheader. Girls lacrosse get a game at 6 p.m. against Denham, and boys get a game at 4 against Denham. Oakland Cowboys, Draymond Green and the Lamar Green. Let's establish that right over the bat. Lamar Green might be the greatest basketball player ever to live. Washington. Boston Celtics point guard Isaiah Thomas said that the team had to be surgically repaired earlier this week. Fell out again during Thursday game three against Washington Wizards, forced him to, to miss the second half as a team. 
The Cowboys were once Super Bowl 52 famous, but Baylor said it. Never teams ran. Said that the Dallas title hopes. Peter Chell new time is 7.05 on this Friday morning. And it's time now for traffic and transit of park. Baby! Let's study off every day where the subway system has several hundred decimal points spent in minor lanes in the traffic. Commuter rail, it's looking good. And on the ferries, they are all looking good on this Friday morning. Oh, wait, look at that. Some highways and byways of New England. 95 on the south bad side. It is slow between Fairfield and Norwalk. Mayor Parkway, west bad side. Back to the street, Bridgewater, and Stanford. A4 east bad side. Slow around the Waterbury stretch. A4 east bad side. Also on Route 72 up in New Britain. A4 west bad side. Also on Interstate 91 Hartford, Connecticut. 291 on the south bad side. Also after the Mass Pike up in Springfield. 391 on the north bad side. Back up by the Oyoke stretch. Mass Pike east bad side. Also on Dedic stretch. 7 Express at the north bad side. So between Bridgewater and the Mass Pike. One way on the north bus side, back between day five. All the way up to Route Nine up in the Wellesley from Denham. Day five on the north bus side, so between the bus three and the north way to Route One Twenty Eight, Canton. Twenty four on the north bus side, so before Route One Twenty Eight, Canton. One forty six on the north bus side, also after Route Two Day Five up in Lincoln, Rhode Island. One twenty eight, south bus side, so between Route Three and Burlington, all the way to Route Two, Electoral. Route Three, east bus side, so between Belmont and Arlington stretch. 93 is stop by the over to Bedford Island and Zaker Bridge. Route 1 is stop by the over to Toba Bridge. Mass by the west by the and there's backed up from Long Island to South Boston. 93 is in the north by the tide. Slow around the river to every turf pocket in the north by the tide also. F2283 up in Manchester River. Pepsburg East by the tide at rate. It's a little slower at 285 for Port of Bay. Main turf pocket on East by the tide also at the Lewiston stretch. And all the way to the yard, the north side, also located with the South Quebec area towards Montreal. And it's 90 on the east bound side of the Berkshire Freeway. It's a little slow around the Chicago Street Freeway, Old Chatham, New York. And Mass Packers, both the also of West Stockbridge in Massachusetts. Peter Chell Duzai, Bears. 707 on this Friday morning. And it is time now for a weather report. And if you're going out and about, on this Friday morning, make sure you got rain gear prepared because it is going to be a silker today. And look at that radar and it shows. Light rain showers in central and western Massachusetts and western suburbs, the northern suburbs of Boston, search for the southern New Hampshire and up in Vermont, northern Rhode Island and western Massachusetts and central and western Connecticut and some slow sleep pelts around. Yep, we're seeing a few hints of sleet east of western and northeast of the north, the island in Vermont. And some spotty snow showers around Mount Washington up in New Hampshire. And zooming out in it, shells a line of rain showers stretching from Quebec and Ontario, stretching all the way down to the border coast. And far west as western Kentucky and Tennessee, and a heavy bend of showers and storms of western Kentucky and southern Indiana. And another heavy, heavy man of rain showers and storms from central Virginia stretching down for the eastern Carolina, where I heard there were a couple of tornado warnings around the North Carolina. And heavy men of showers up to South Carolina. All right. Future cast that shows that rain's gonna be in Connecticut and Western Massachusetts by about 9 o'clock, and then heavy band of rain showers around the New York City vicinity by about 11 a.m., and then it'll make its way through Connecticut and Summer Island by about 1.39, and then the heavy band of showers and storms gonna make its way to the Baltimore vicinity and Central Western Massachusetts Connecticut by about 5 o'clock, and then it'll make its way to Eastern Massachusetts going to the Northern area by about 6 o'clock, and then it'll be out of here. But after it passes the Cape Cod by about the midnight hour, so we get again another batch of heavy rain around this region by about 7 a.m. Okay, let's take a look at our forecast, and we got 
Has the word outlet? My God! Has the word outlet? Look for set the master just six to the master just stop into the iron and stop into the master just stop the iron and stop in the iron. Flood watch. Flood watch effect from two p.m. Eastern daylight time this afternoon about Saturday morning. That's what's very conservation of flood watch for a portion of master just every night, including the flooded areas and master just crystal central and stop into Middlesex, Essex, Norfolk, Plymouth, Southern Worcester, and Suffolk and Rhode Island, Bristol, Kent, Northport, Providence, and Washington County. From 2 p.m. Eastern Day, I have this afternoon about 8 a.m. Saturday morning. Low pressure says it will be past west of New England tonight. There's so spread widespread rain across region. We'll all clear every downpour. The wildly scattered thunderstorms. The heaviest rain will fall by mid afternoon for tonight. Widespread 1 and 2 inch amounts are expected. The rainfall may reach 2 to 3 inches in east of Massachusetts and Vermont. There's potential for moderate urban and poor drainage flooding. Rainfall rates at 1 inch per hour are possible in downpours as well as thunderstorms. A flood watch means that there's potential for flooding based on. Current forecast, you should monitor later forecast and alert for possible flood warnings. These living in areas prone to flooding should be prepared to take action and should flood and develop. Alright, seven day forecast goes like this. Today, rain may have 1 p.m. The rain can be every time. Much fog up to 2 p.m. I know 57 degrees. East about 3 to 8 miles an hour. Just dive set. New person much between half to three quarters inch possible for threat. Rain and possibly a thunderstorm before midnight. The rain between midnight and 1 a.m. Then a rain and possibly a thunderstorm after 1 a.m. Southern stores could be same rainfall. Fresh fog go at 55 degrees and south about 8 miles an hour. Suspicion 1%. percent Do a rain run between 1 and 2 inches as possible. Southern days, showers like that, possibly a thunderstorm. Fresh fog before 11 a.m. Our last cost count have at 66 degrees and south about 8 to 10 miles. Cost at 32 miles an hour. Suspicion 7 percent New percent between a quarter and a half an inch possible for a Saturday night and Chester Shadow Bay before 1 a.m. Most of the cost could go at 47 degrees and south wind about 6 to 8 miles an hour. Suspicion 4 percent Sunday, church shots really up to 10 a.m. But she says about 62 degrees and something about 7 to 10 miles an hour. Just say it's 20 miles an hour. Church page is 30%. Sunday night, and church shots. That's what mostly cuts about 41 degrees and church page is 30%. Monday, puts on most of cuts about 30 about 30 degrees. Tuesday, puts on most of cuts about 30 about 41 degrees. Wednesday, church shots mostly cuts about 30 about 40 degrees and church page is 30%. And for Thursday, church shots mostly cuts about 30 degrees and church page is 40%. And currently it's all in it. Toby Cass said it's 50. Here at Naughton, it is overcast. 47 degrees at Menfield. It's seeing a little light rain. It's 47, and that's going to be it for the Peter Chell Morning News at 7 a.m. on its May 5th, 2079, a Friday morning. I appreciate you have a good morning and good bye to the and hope you have a good day and stay dry in the rain. I hope you all have a good day.